And we're back. Okay, so this is Gamer Cal again, doing more of TSRPR because I've decided that this is what I'm going to do today, basically. And yeah, let's just go ahead and go into the Goomba Playground. It's a playground that's full of Goombas, apparently. And it's also full of dinosaurs, it seems. Hmm. And Yoshi has a very odd connection with the Goombas. And uh, there's a thing down here. Uh, I got a hidden life at some point that took me by surprise, and I don't know where it is. Um, honestly, I don't know. There was a that life took me by surprise when I tried to do this the first time, and yeah. So we have pipes that go up. It's pretty good, and we have a dead ham above a guy, and they are seriously annoying, but. We have the ability to spit fire, so we'll just decide to completely destroy the better ability of, sp of flying, you know, because that's what all logical people do, they destroy the ability that's better. And we have fire flowers. Uh, yep, yeah, okay. And we have more moving pipes, yay. And this guy could be annoying. Uh, Huh, out of the way, guy. So, the Goomba Playground, at least at the moment, doesn't have a whole lot of Goombas. It's just got a lot of flying hammers, and my camera blinked again. Why the hell does it do that? Oh, whatever. Um, yeah, there's not really a whole lot to say. It's just a lot of pipe jumps with not a lot of Goombas. And it's a flying cannon pipe, and a midpoint. Yay. And an extra life because we are out of a Yoshi egg. Hmm. Ah, so now we get the Goombas, and we also have a choice of what item we want. So I think I will take the Feather. Since I already have the Fire Flower, you know, we'll take what's better. And um, yeah, Yoshi just devours anything you, you know, feed him with, so... Oh. Ah, you'd swear I did that on purpose. Uh, right, so this is the flying block section, I guess. Where we'll just waste fire for no reason. Other than it's cool, I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, it's rather slow moving. I never liked the background during these things because it always looked so confusing. Looks as if you're moving so fast and you actually aren't at all. And that's a goal. I guess. It's, it looks like a goal anyway, and it's given us fanfare music. <laughs> it's a goal. But there's a secret in this level as well, so I will be right back when I get there. And here we are, here's the cannon guy. Except, if you go this way, you'll see there's a pipe with green blocks in it. It's the green switch palace. And there's munchers all over the floor, yay. I guess if you bought the Yoshi, you could probably just walk all over those, but... Uh, there's a P-switch. I don't know where you're supposed to use this actually, so I'll just use it here. Oh, ah, okay. So it's basically a, oh hi, we have a P-switch that just gives you coins everywhere. Just like last time. Oh, that didn't work at all. Oh well. So we've lost a feather, who cares. Uh, we're gonna get tons of feathers from this thing anyway, the green switch. Yay! And we'll just fast forward that. There we go. Cave exploration. Okay, we'll put a save state here. I said we'll put a save state here so that I at least have one for the next video. And it's a moving level with a conveyor belt as well, just to add more entertainment. Auto scroll and the platform moves as well. Isn't that dandy? 
Why did I say dandy? Oh. God knows. But yeah, the music's quite cool for the cave as well, so... And we have a jump. Yeah, it's pretty good. You know, it's a platformer. It's supposed to have jumps. And there's a piranha plant. And there's a green block. Which I will take happily, you know. And there's a pipe we can go up. And we go up from the underground to water with a key. So clearly this is going to be a secret exit. And there it is. If you can ever get up there. Oh, you'd swear I was doing that on purpose, wouldn't you? There we go. A very non-hidden secret exit to an iceberg, which is also a red level. So we'll just completely ignore that and go back and do the normal exit. So yeah, this platform is quite weird. It gives the illusion that it's moving as well, but it actually isn't. You're staying still on that platform, of course, and you also spot was taking you forward. Kind of, it's a cool illusion, though. Hey, extra life. That takes us to 25. Wow, how have I got 325,000 points already? So, on with the rest of the normal level, then. So the lava just disappears at that point. It, it just don't, eh, I'm gonna just go away now and leave you. And oh, the spikes fall. Oh dear. Um, this could get hairy. Uh, yay for having a kid. Man, I didn't have to try during that at all. <laughs> so we have Yoshi coin and no out of nowhere, and we have coins out of just as nowhere and. Yeah, we have also scroll, I guess. Ah, uh, huh. Now, if you'd have stayed on that platform, you would have been really annoyed by now, I guess. And into the next part of the level. Uh, there's some pipes. It's pretty good. And there's something up here. And this fourth Yoshi coin. Ah, uh, yeah. Leap of faith. Even though it's not really a leap of faith because you can see where you're going. And that guy's going to reappear soon. I uh, didn't quite think about that. Oh. What the hell were you doing there? Honestly. <laughs> That's just silly. Oh, well, we get an item back anyway, so... Oh. Huh. Okay. Let's take the shell with us. Into the goal. And we get a life. Woo. <laughs> so we get a life for carrying a shell to the goal. That's quite cool. Well, at least I think it's cool anyway. Uh, yeah, so I think that's going to do just now. Four exits seems fair enough. Uh, this is Gamer Carl, and join me next time whenever the video uploads.